Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is JP Silverwolf, and my microphone is retracted. There we go. You're watching ZPGNet, your source for personality-driven content, and I'm playing Sky Factory 2. Okay, so... A few things that we've done here. You know, we've added this here uh, second level to our smeltery. Hi, guys. And then back there, kind of bouncing around, you see the top of her head. We've got like a witch or something that's moved in. She's a coven witch. So if we ever get into witchery, she can help us. Uh, I accidentally walled her in back there. So whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, let's see. What else have we done here? Oh, over here. Over here. We've figured out how to automate cobble coming out. Uh-huh. Okay, out of the transfer node and going directly into this crucible. Which is pretty goddamn amazing. I'm actually going to uh, change how this is set up so I can show you how it works. Out comes transfer node. Okay. So what you do is you plonk down the transfer node like so. Okay. And then you're going to hook it up with pipes. Blam. Okay. Now we're going to get rid of the excess pipes because we don't need all those cluttering up the place. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, just leave it like that. Then in here goes the world interaction node or upgrade. Let's put that in there. Bam. There. Now it'll dig it out and stick it into this lava bucket. And as you can see, it's already full of lava, which is pretty fucking cool. But I think we can do one better. So, let's just go see what's all floating around here. Uh, oh my goodness. Oh my gracious. Oh my god. I am. So I totally forgot to put up my usual posts on, uh, uh, what do you call it there? Uh, oh my god, what do I call it? Google Plus! Duh. So, you know, I just decided to throw that on there while I had a chance. Let's see what's going on in here. Another thing we're going to do is we're going to automate this bitch. Because I am tired of coming over here and just breaking people's faces in. So, we're going to look into how to do that today. Loot crates! Ooh, loot bag. Rare. Another helmet. I'm gonna melt that bitch down. For the apprentice ring of Equa. Okay, so bam. So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna run back here. Da, 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 da. And we're gonna look into how to begin the process of automating this bitch. So, as you can see, I've got quite a few blocks of iron here. I've got six. 
So that should be enough to start with phase one, which is the fan. Okay. Well, you've tried this before, dude. You couldn't find the fucking fan. Well, that's right, because it was way the fuck down here on page 10 at the bottom. An open blocks fan, number 1505. Iron bars, iron ingot, and a slab. Okay, so iron bars is just one, two, three, four, five, six of these. So that should be actually really easy. We're just going to get boop, one of these. Okay, six is fine. I'm going to stick it in the old crafting bench here. We're going to break these down into iron blocks. Ingots, I'm sorry. Da, 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 da. Okay. Take that, take that out. Okay, cool. We're going to need some stone slabs. Let's go over here. I was crushing cobblestone for stuff earlier, so let's just go ahead and throw all this back in here. Okay, there we go. Now, is this... Oh, wait, hold on. So we're going to make six of these, so... Wait, one, two. I really only need four of these. Okay. Now, the other thing we're going to need is some iron spikes. Spike. Bam. Iron spike. Takes three swords, three ingots, and a block. So, uh, sticks. Actually, don't I have some swords? I feel like I've gotten swords before. There's an axe, or a pickaxe, I should say. Greetings, program. Thanks for watching. I don't know who you are. Um, no, not over here. Save that for later, then. Run, 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 run. I seriously feel like we've gotten a sword before. Uh, I guess not. Unless it's maybe over here. Oh! Iron sword. Cool. Alright, well, now that we've got that. Grab some sticks. Alright, now we need to make two more of these iron swords. That's actually not very hard. It's just one, two, like that. Cool. Now we just put these in a little thing here, a little base here, and then iron swords go here. Splatow, we've got four iron spikes. Now we can start automating this bitch. So let's get over here. We're going to make some renovations. Ah, before I forget, there's one other thing I wanted to do. I'm gonna need you guys. I think we can make this over here, actually. So let's just get over here. Uh, we're gonna make a slightly larger chest. So, first things first, we need to come over here and clear this place out. So, let's clear it out. Man, I am earning Chivos today. Today is Chivo Day. Okay, that looks like everybody. So, let's start by breaking... Our monster spawner. Oops. Boom. Okay. 
So what we're gonna do, just gonna get this loot bag out of here. Let's see what's in here. Describe her name press. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. okay. All right. So we're gonna have to go outside a little bit. That's fine. That's fine. So we need to look up vacuum hopper. Vacuum uh, hopper. Here we are. Huh. Hopper. Hopper upgrade. Hopper. Up. There it is. Vacuum hopper. It just takes a hopper, a piece of obsidian, and an eye of ender. Fuck! An eye of ender? Well, good news is we've got some extra ender pearls, so we'll come back for that. Let's just put this stuff in here. There we go. That, that, that. Okay, so now that this is broken, we're going to have to expand a little bit. So it looks like we're going to be needing a lot more planks as well. Okay, we'll just have to get back to that. Okay, well, since I'm here, let's go ahead and make a slightly bigger chest. So we're going to throw this together here, bam, put that there, and then we're going to surround this with iron, bam, iron chest, boosh. Now, if I'm not mistaken, an iron chest is significantly larger, so it should be easier to deal with. Now that we've made that, I think we'll be alright to get the rest of this down off our mob jerky. Need that. Okay. Alright, so let's start with this thing here. Do, 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 do. Oh, shit. Really? Okay. Uh. We could probably make this deeper too. Let's do that. So now that this is going to be too deep, bam, 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 we should be able to build a little bit more efficiently here. We're going to make a little extra space over here because this is where the fans are going to go. Bam, bam. And I'll show you real quick what I mean here. So Uh, these are positioned wrong, of course. Okay. And then what's going to happen is we're going to have two fans here. Like a soul. And these are going to push them this way, and this is going to push them that way. So when it's all said and done, it's just going to drive them into these spikes I'm going to install. 